Training to muscular failure is a concept introduced during the 1940s by the physician Thomas Delorme, who at the time published a series of articles advocating the use of this method. Today, many bodybuilders and trainers swear by this practice and found scientific proof of their beliefs in three studies that found failure training to be more effective in increasing muscle growth than non-failure training. However, things are not that simple. These studies compare failure sets with sets that had 3 to 6 reps in reserve. This means that the non-failure trials were stopping at 3 to 6 repetitions before failure. But this is a much lower training intensity than what is commonly advised by fitness professionals. For this reason, when training to failure was compared with non-failure sets with 3 or fewer reps in reserve, 4 studies found no differences between them. So, training to failure or 3 to 1 reps close to failure didn't produce differences for muscle growth. 